Hello and welcome to my interesting pictures. Bad news everywhere. Whether you watch TV, take a look in the newspaper or somewhere else online. Pretty much everywhere you see so many bad news. But why? Why don't we live in a world where good news are also produced? Why do we have the set of mind that the world is bad because of media? This sort of thing is called agenda setting. Media sets the agenda for a couple of weeks, for a couple of days, for a certain topic. They will report about this topic all the time and make the public really aware of the problem or the things which are going on. This overproduction of bad news leads to the fact that people actually think that the world is worse than it actually is. In Münster, three students had the idea to actually come up with a journalistic magazine or website which actually gives constructive solutions for certain problems. This project is called Perspective Daily. I will also leave you the link down below so you can check out their website. But what is it really about? What do they want? Well, they don't want classic journalism in the form like we know it. They want constructive journalism which gives people not only the report about bad things or things in general, but also the solutions for it. Though on Perspective Daily you won't get the huge variety you will get on topics uh, you will get on a newspaper or uh, well, other you know, traditional journalistic websites, rather you will get less articles with more content, which means they won't only discuss the topic itself but also will connect the topic to different topics so you will get a broader view on the topic itself. Apart from that, as I said, Perspective Daily also wants to concentrate on the positive news in the world because, well, we get negative news everywhere. No? I mean, if you take a look at normal newspapers, normally the front page is like full of bad information. Not bad information, but like, you know, maybe devastating news, which will, you know, set your mind about the world in a kind of bad way. Perspective Daily is actually a crowdfunding project, and they just recently reached that 12,000 uh, subscription and subscriber. And I think that's a very good sign for journalism in general. Because, especially nowadays, with, you know, all the refugee crisis and stuff like this, especially especially in Germany, people think that the media is not really honest with them. So a media which is more constructive gives you more solutions is I think a very good sign and it appears that people really like it. Well the service doesn't come for free obviously, it will cost you 42 euros a year which is I think still alright, it's actually promotion price, it's 60 euro normally and I think it's actually alright if you compare it to normal newspapers because sometimes they will even charge you more. Due to crowdfunding, they actually just gained 500,000 euros, which is a lot of money in. Well, we need to see and wait whether or not they can translate this into proper journalism in the future and, you know, that their project actually succeeds. So, yeah, let's wait and see. Especially for me as an upcoming journalist, I think this is a very good sign that journalism today is still working. But perhaps we need to get away from the traditional one to actually more modern and new one. Maybe a new perspective is the way to go, which is maybe perspective daily. That was a rhyme, but not too bad. <laughs> As I said, I will leave you the links down below in the description so you can check out their website. And I want to thank you ever so much. And by the way, outside there, construction work is going on, and I'm really, I'm really not prepared because every like every minute I need to wait until they finish. <sighs> I will leave you the links for Perspective Daily down below in the description so you can check it out by yourself and you should definitely do so. We will see us in the next My Interesting Pictures video and until then I hope we won't have any more dis uh, construction work going on. And until then, uh, yeah, have a good day, bye bye.